Hey everybody, so here we are, ColecoVision fan page, and we are doing a preview of Exidy slash Collector Vision's new Ripcord. Let's go ahead and jump right into this game. Um, as you can see, we see some credits on the screen, etc., etc. Awesome people, we thank you for making the game. Okay. Now, one thing to know about uh, Ripcord is this was one of the original ColecoVision games that was announced. And I will also tell you that this is the first time I am playing this game. And I, so I apologize if I suck at it. I've played the arcade game a couple times. Here, let's see if we can go. If I remember right, and, oh, okay, I did it. If you look up in the top, I have like some goals that I have to make. And I'm not going to make the 20, and I'm not going to make the 10, and I have died. Okay, so there's a 10, 20, and 50 up there, which means I need to get to one of the 20 platforms. It ain't happening for me either. But let's try to get back down to the 10. All right, I think I have, I have eight jumps left. Let's try this one down here. Oh, do not kill me, helicopter. I know you want to. Yes! All right, so anyway, Ripcord was an original ColecoVision game, or sorry, it was, was uh, not, not a ColecoVision game. Well, let, let me step back because I'm talking dumb. Um, so it was a game by Exidy that was part of the original ColecoVision lineup, or at least it was supposed to be. Um, you saw a picture of it in the, uh, the catalog that came with your ColecoVision. Uh, it was on the back of the box for the uh, ColecoVision, but it never came out. And that was, what, 30-something? Oh, 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 make it, yes! All right. That was 30-something years ago. And we now finally have a really faithful version of Ripcord coming from Exidy slash Collector Vision. For those of you guys that don't know, Collector Vision has been making home. I'm going to die. They have been making homebrew games for the ColecoVision since I think 2008. So they, uh, for a long time, and and I just got destroyed by a helicopter. That's gotta hurt. Ow. So they've been making games since 2008, um, and they've been responsible for a, a couple of other of the Vaporware games, like Sidetrack and uh, Chess Challenger, um, that you saw in the original catalogs but never came out. So it's awesome that they keep bringing these games to life that uh, we all as kids sort of looked at the catalogs and I'm dead. We looked at the catalogs and wanted, but never had them. And now here I am as a 40-something old man. I am finally playing the Ripcord game that I wanted to play when I was 12. And dear Collectivision, we thank you for that. This is sort of an official Exidy release. Um, Collectivision did actually license and buy the rights to the Exidy label. So, oh, am I going to make it? No, that guy's just going to kick my ass. So technically, you know, even though this game is, uh, you know, coming out under Collector Vision, it is also branded as Exidy and kind of officially in that sense. Can I make it? Let's see. No, no, no. Oh, I did make it. Yes. It, it's actually not the easiest game in the world. It, it uh, you know, it's a, almost like a little bit like if you remember the Atari 2600 game Skydiver, kind of like a... Um, an update on that. Again, super fun that, that we we're finally playing this game after all these years. And I remember seeing it on, you know, the box of the ColecoVision in those catalogs. And it pretty much lives up to, to what I would have expected. Come on, come on, make it. Let's see. Oh! Now things are going to get tough. All right. Um, oh, jeez. Okay, wait. It is now impossible for me to do anything. So, sorry, little guy. I had to sacrifice you. Okay, let's go for... Let's go for the... No, oh, I'm going to die no matter what. Yep. Okay. Well, hello. All right. Let's see. Timing-wise, I guess I don't have... Oh, let's see if we can make the 20. And no, the helicopter's going to kill me again. Damn it. 
Did I mention this is actually the very first time that I'm playing this game? So, I do apologize if I suck at it. Um, oh, 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 no, 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 no. I have a feeling this is going to become the end of me very soon here. Let's, let's try one of these down here. Come on, get to that 10. Yes! Alright, so the only one I have left now is the 50. And I'm going to wait until I have an opening in these helicopters. God damn it, no, that's still... All right, let me try to release my little guy. Come on, get, get, go, 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 yes! All right, I think I can do it. Yes, all right. So again, it's available at collectorvision.com. Go to their website. Um, it's either should be available, you know, for pre-order or very soon. I know those guys said they're gonna try to get it out in December. And we'll also post another video and an update when it is actually released, but I at least wanted to give you guys a preview look. This was very nice of the helicopters to stay on that side of the island. Oh, no, see, I say that, and the dude came over. He knew I was talking. Alright, uh, so now we're back to... Come on, I want to get that 50. Yes! And nope, not gonna do it. And nope, still not gonna do it. I have a feeling timing is everything on this game. If I remember right, I think the original um, Ripcord was a black and white game, so it's kinda nice to see, uh, nice to see it colorized. It's like those those movies from the 60s where they're like, hey, we're going to colorize this film and make it shitty, but they actually made this better. So, go Collector Vision. Oh, come on! I had that one. Just opened my parachute a little bit too late. All right, guys, there it is. Ripcord. Having a great time playing it. Go to CollectorVision.com. Place your order as soon as possible. Um, and thank you to everybody involved for keeping the ColecoVision alive. Especially these three guys. 